What up, guys? Uh, Jelly Beans, a friend from Streamer House, and I'm gonna be going over the Dung Beetle. It was added uh, late last week uh, into Ark Survival Evolve, and I I kind of summoned one in and tamed it just because I didn't feel like going through the hassle of you know going into the cave and trying to tame it there. Um, these guys will only spawn in caves, so if you need if you want to get one of these guys, which I highly recommend, you you have to go into a cave system to get it. Um, they're going to be near the watery sources, things like that. These are what they look like. They're nice little critters. Now, the cool thing about these guys is uh, they can produce fertilizer for you by eating poop. Um, now, to tame these guys to do that, um, you're gonna, it's, a, it's a passive tame, so you're going to have to follow it around um, very slowly and feed it poop whenever it's hungry, which is really funny. <laughs> Um, and then once you tame it, you can take it back to your base and uh, you can start feeding it poop to turn the poop into fertilizer and also give you oil. Super awesome. So we've already put uh, a large poopy in here and now we have uh, three fertilizer from that one and six oil. So it's very useful. Now to, for to make the fertilizer out of the poop, you're going to have to uh, have it on wander. That's the only way that it'll make the, the fertilizer and the oil. Um, so what I have done, which makes it very easy, is uh, taking the beetles and put them in these little cages here so that uh, you can uh, just have them on wander and you can still access their inventory here. I'll show you with this beetle over here. This guy is on wander and I, anywhere in the, in the cage I can still access his inventory. You know, take out, take out the fertilizer and then put a new poopy in. Um, they can only really process up to like eight pounds. If you want to up the weight, you can. Um, so you can put two poops in there instead of just one. Um, I would recommend doing that just so you can get as much done as possible. It's pretty, it's pretty simple. But uh, yeah, these are the dung beetles. They're super awesome and cool. Um, I will put a link in the description of the map where all the cave systems are. So if you want to find these guys and tame them, you can pick them up with an Argentavis or a Quetz. So if you want to carry them back to your base to tame them there versus having to deal with, you know, the hostility of a cave system, which has bats and, and spiders and scorpions and snakes and piranhas and all the other stuff, it'll make it a lot easier doing that. Um, but yeah, I'll put links in the description down below, um, as, as well as the, uh, the ARC Encyclopedia of, <laughs> or whatever it's called, um, of the Dung Beetle, which gives you a description on... Um, how much tame you'll get per large large poopy or depending on the size of the poop you use to tame them um, because it's going to differentiate between if you use spoiled meat, small small poop, medium poop, or large poop when it has to do with uh, taming this dung beetle. Um, but that's it for this video guys. Have a good day and I will see you guys tomorrow.